stood in the car. Why is that I can't see the red light on there? It's recording. Okay. Oh well, let's see what we can deal with here. Now, we've dealt with several things that we've put on sites, as I said earlier. I want you to think back to the Kabbalah. There are nine spheres of existence. I know that the Kabbalah deals with ten, but we're only interested in nine. Now, this isn't just a Judaism or Kabbalah. Kabbalistic thing. This is also covered in the shamans. It's also covered in uh, Vedic. All of them talk about this. So, what is our objective. We learn different things, we learn Reiki, we learn Pranic healing. But now let's get down to something else which is important and that's changing our environment. To change your living conditions and your environment, you apply the same principles. Apply the principles of Shambhala. You manipulate matter. You know, in the old days this was called magic, witchcraft, wizardry. But really, is science. When you focus on a particular thing and the focus is intent, you release minute subatomic particles. These subatomic particles will interface or interrelate with other subatomic particles. such as what appears solid to you, such as appear that job that you wanted and you don't know how to get it. You may not have a job, you don't know what to do. Why? Because you are panicked. When panic sets in, all else stops. It's like a big wall. And when that wall is up, nothing gets through. So stop the panic first. Nothing, I've stressed this over and over again, nothing is impossible. You can do anything you wish. The only thing that stops you really is you. Why have so low esteem that, so, oh, I couldn't possibly do that, or I couldn't possibly do this? Well, you can. You have the same brain mass here as what I have, as what Dark Ravenwood has, as what Adrian has. You have two arms, two legs. Do not let things annoy you. There are no such thing, for a start off, as strangers. Strangers are friends you, you have not yet met. All is connected to you. All. 
Witchcraft is the way of the wise. We do not practice Wicca. We practice witchcraft. An earth religion. Uh, well, no, it's not a religion. It's a way of life. We respond to the earth. The earth closes, it feeds us. There's a thing I wanted to mention concerning Reiki. If you're wearing nylon, you realize this inhibits Reiki energy. A person will not get the full extent of Reiki, can't, doesn't penetrate, our nylon for good. That also includes terylene, polyester, etc. etc. Wear silk or wear cotton, one of the two. Says he, dressed in polyester. Some of you will also find that you're using and studying prana. Pranic or life force, it's a, new, it's a system that is new to you, it may feel alien to you. If you don't feel comfortable with it, don't do it. But it does work, it's powerful. The most powerful system of Reiki I have used, and Adrian has used, Dark Raven one and a few others is Shambhala. I have never known a Reiki as powerful. Now, those who have got wands, if you're doing distant Reiki, draw the symbol in the air with your wand. Uh, focus. When you, you, when you focus on someone, you see them with your mind's eye and then you draw the symbol and then focus everything into them you will be astounded at the power that you will generate. You want abundance, put your money on your altar, put some money on the altar. Move your wand around that money three times. You're causing a vortex. It's nothing magical. Magic is just a science that is not yet known. That's all. There is, next week I will be do, dealing with pranic energy. I'll be dealing with quite a lot next week. Um, I hope that you're all practicing the hand thingy in pranic energy. It's important that you get the sensitivity in the palms of your hands before I can take you into the next step. Then we'll go into to scanning the outer aura. I also want to deal with auras, how to see auras. There is so much that you can do that I've covered all this before but you still, some of you still haven't grasped it. I want to thank uh, Moon, Moon Dancer, whoopee, I said it right. Thank you, Carol. Thank you, Moon Dancer, for sending me my staff. It will be very, very special. And because of this, I thank you. I mean, you've done so much for me, it's unbelievable. And we're now getting very close to Christmas. Uh, we've already discussed here uh, what we're going to send our families over the Christmas. That's already sorted. Uh, I had a little bit of trouble with um, uh, Earthwalker, but Cla uh, <laughs> Dark Raven One and myself have sorted this out. Okay. I gather it's time that I came off of this again. Thank you for listening to me and bringing me into your home. I'm Shanti. Merry we have met, merry we part, merry to meet again.